Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd show you what I've brought for Ted's Christmas Eve box. Thought I would show you what I'm going to put in Ted's Christmas Eve box this year. Um, I've never done a Christmas Eve box for him before. Last year I think I let him open a present early, but this year I thought it might be quite nice to give him some bits on Christmas Eve, make it a bit more exciting for him. So the first present I bought him was a magazine from Sainsbury's. This was $3.99 in Sainsbury's. Um, we normally buy him a magazine like once a month as a little treat or something or if he's done really well because um, they are quite expensive but they are lovely um, and it has some great stickers in it, some colouring things to do and some puzzles and stuff. So, and it has a toy on the front as well. I don't know what's inside the toy, but I'm sure it's something good because he normally loves the toys on the fronts of these magazines. So I thought that was a great present for him. Um, and the next one I got was a Santa's Christmas activity box, also brought in Sainsbury's. This was four pounds from Sainsbury's and it actually has four books in it so it has a colouring, a doodles, a party puzzles and a Santa's stickers. He loves stickers so he'll probably really enjoy the sticker book and I thought the other three books over the years will probably be used um, every Christmas. I might put them away and just bring them out of Christmas so I thought that was quite a good book, quite a, book, quite a good present for him. Um, the next present I got was a jumper for Christmas Day um, this is a music and light up nose, so just listen to this. You know that's going to annoy the hell out of the adults when, when it comes to Christmas Day. Um, this was £10 from Primark. They didn't have much of a choice in Primark, I have to say. But this was one of the better ones, so I thought I'd get him that for Christmas Day. Um, and then the next present I got was some Christmas pyjamas for Christmas Eve night. Um, as you can see, they're Minions. And it's got Naughty Nice, Tried My Best. And obviously it has a tick by Tried My Best. So I got him some Minion pyjamas. And it has some matching bottoms with those as well. They're quite cool. They've got little snowflakes and minions on them, so they were quite cute. And then the next present I got was, it's a very merry Muppet movie Christmas. Um, we love the Muppets in this house, so I'm sure if we manage to sit down and watch it on Christmas Eve evening, then uh, we will enjoy, all enjoy that. So yeah, and then the next present I got was Mr. Men, A White Christmas. It's a Christmas book for Christmas Eve night. Just to get us in the mood for Christmas Day. And then the last present I got was just a little chocolate Santa. I don't like to fill Ted's sacks and, and like Christmas presents with sweets and chocolate too much, but I like to give him it occasionally. So this one is from Hotel Chocolat, so it's a little bit better quality. Um, I got this as part of a deal so it was like three for five pounds or something. So I got a few other little bits as well to put in their Christmas um, stockings for, for them to open on Christmas Day. And this is the last thing I've done is just to wrap a box in Christmas wrapping paper um, to make it look a bit more festive. Um, I've used Phoenix Cars wrapping paper. I buy mine from a lady called Claire O'Grady. I will link her Facebook page down below. Um, this is, I can't remember how much this was, but it is very good quality paper and it doesn't rip easily either. So it's wrapped this box really well, although I think I will cover it in sticky back plastic as well. So I'm just going to put all of Ted's presents in there. The magazine I might just put in a separate envelope. And that's Ted's, and that's Ted's Christmas Eve box this year. So that's Ted's Christmas Eve box for this year. I hope it's given you some ideas and some inspiration for your own Christmas Eve boxes. Please feel free to like, comment or subscribe below. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I hope to see you all again soon. See you later. Bye.